Yeah, Steve, first home game, first mm. home win. Well done. What did you make of it? Well, really pleased to get the win. Obviously, you know, you, you want to get the, the first win um, on the board at the start of the season. So good that we've that we've done that. That was obviously the main objective from the game. I thought we started really well, not just because we scored. I thought we were excellent for 30 minutes. Um, the learning from it is, you know, score more. Um, I'm not saying put the game to bed, but I think we could have made it more comfortable than um, than what we did. Um, and I, I didn't, I didn't really love the last 15 minutes and the complacency that kicked in, kicked in our, our game. I thought that um, we didn't need to do that. You know, we, if anything, we should have ramped it up more. And a couple of unforced errors came to, came in. And um, um, you know, half time I thought come at a good time because it was a chance for me to get into the guys a little bit and say, come on, you've been really good for 30 minutes. You know, don't don't stop doing that. Um, and then it did it did seep into the start of the, the second half, and the balls went back to Matt too early, you know. And um, we, we, they've had a little little spell with corners and scored from it. So, if anything, after we regrouped, it, it, it ended up being a, I won't say a good thing, but something that sort of got got us back on track. And I thought we were excellent then, for the last sort of 30, 40 minutes of the game. I thought we took the game to to Sheffield. Of course, we were the better team. Of course, we were the team that deserved to win. Um, but you've got to go and do that, you know. And I thought that we we were the we were the team with the high numbers at the pitch. We were the team trying to get in behind. We were the team trying to create real real chances. And I'm just really pleased that, you know, we we did get there in the end. And um, I mean, I have to say, you know, although it would have been an absolute gift because of the unforced error, Matt's made a brilliant save. I mean, it come out come out with nothing, and it reminded me a little bit of Bournemouth last last year. Um, but um, but Matt's done what we know he does he can he can really uh, make them save so um and i think that was important for him to have that moment although i didn't love it at the time <laughs> um and then um and then i think yeah, i thought we were excellent then in terms of you know the, the the changes we changed shape and and you know looked strong and um you know showed show great quality for the, for the for the winning goal and um nearly got a third it would have been great if anthony had got on the end of that off morgan but um um so really pleased with the win, really pleased with some of our play because it was really, really top. But at the same time, didn't like how we gave Sheffield United hope in the game because there was no need for that. Mm. Um, those substitutions you make and that mm. you, you mentioned and, and the change of shape, that um, gave you a bit of added impetus, didn't mm. it? It really got you going again, if you like, for well, a well, second win perhaps. Yeah, well, I just felt it was a game and, and the coaching staff sort of, we did it together. We, we felt it was a game there for the taking mm. and, and especially the, the way the first half or the first 30 minutes was. So... Um, so we made them positive changes, and um, and they ended up having having a good impact. Or, uh, but the players deserve the credit, and you know, not the guys who play the ninety minutes, but also the guys who come off the bench and came off as well. I mean, this is an era where it's a hundred-minute game. Um, it's you need more than you start in eleven. You need strikers to score in the first half and strikers to come off the bench to score in the second half. And um, I mean, I'm really pleased for Taiwu again, but I'm really, really pleased for Woody because. Um, he's come back from a long-term injury, showed great commitment, he's a real leader in the dressing room, he's part of the leadership group and we need to get behind everybody now and, and because you know th these guys can make a real difference for us. So, um, top finishes from both of them, great assists, Serge, with cross Serge's crossing was brilliant all night, which was part of the, of, of the plan in getting the wing-backs or the full-backs or the wingers that end up being high up the pitch. Felt that we could score from crosses, so I'm really pleased that that, that, was, that was the case. But yeah, I mean... Um, Good impetus in the game, and um, like I said, we deserve to win the game. But we, maybe we should have made it a little bit easier than what it ended up being. Um, no, Ola Aina in the uh, yeah. in the starting lineup. Well, not in the squad tonight. Is, does that suggest he's he's got a little knock? Or? Yeah, he just tweaked his groin in the uh, uh, like in training a couple of days ago. So nothing too serious, and we, we 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 give every chance for him to be ready for tonight. And unfortunately, just fell a bit short. So nothing too serious. But um, but Nico came in and. Um, we just need, you know, we, we, we need a squad that can come in and have an impact and, you know, we, we, we're working hard to try and add to the squad, make changes and um, if that happens, then brilliant. If, if it doesn't, then we carry on. So, um, um, yeah, just day by day, get on with our work. New season, no lessening of the atmosphere around ah, this brilliant. place. Yeah, I mean, like, and, and, and yeah, I mean, we've, we've created something here, haven't we, that we, can, we, we have to hold on to because... I know that we took our foot off the gas. The lads will know that. Shouldn't have let them back into the game, but we did. But no frustration. Probably felt it internally, the, 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 the fans. But again, they showed the opposite and uh, got the guys back on board. And the guys give them what, what, what they deserve. But this, this place is class, isn't it? You know, it's, uh, yeah, so sometimes it's easy to get lost in the atmosphere and, and stay, you know, lose focus on the game. Not saying that I do, but um, 
yeah, I just love I just love being here and especially on nights like tonight. So but back to train tomorrow, loads to learn and um loads to, to, to get better at and um you know we, we aim to have some good good more moments.